Nestled in the boreal forest of northern Saskatchewan on the Clearwater River Dene Nation, Cora LeMegg is making history. She went to high school on this reserve and this fall she'll be back in the classroom as a certified teacher. I'm happy, I'm proud, I'm excited. Even more remarkable, she got her Bachelor of Education degree right here on the reserve with lessons on Denny culture and language. Who are we as Denny people if we do not speak our Denny tongue? So, like, who do we recognize ourselves as? She's one of 21 teachers to graduate from the Dene Education Teacher Program. Across Canada, Indigenous languages are disappearing. The Clearwater River School teaches Dene immersion from kindergarten to grade 12, but it's been tough to find teachers. A university program in the community was a long shot. But then... One of Canada's deadliest school shootings. In 2016, a high school student in Laloche went on a shooting rampage, killing four people, wounding seven others. With the shooting, I think governments felt obliged to help out with a unique program like this. A free four-year program. Rena Lemeg signed up. Before the program started, I was feeling lost. Um, I didn't know where to go and I was kind of sad and depressed at the same time and then that's when my life changed for the better. The students learned from elders out on the land and from professors who traveled north. The Water River Dene School was the only building in North America where you could learn in an indigenous language from three years old right to the bachelor's level to the university level. So that's something uh, the whole community was, was very proud of. Ferris LeMay couldn't speak Dene when she enrolled. But I was younger, it was always that comment, like, oh, you're Dene, you have to speak the language, but I couldn't. And now I understand what kids are going through, and I feel like I could encourage them when they're trying to learn the language, because I've been in their shoes. Now she can speak, read, and write Dene, and she feels more comfortable in her own skin. I'm proud, like, I, I feel like I found myself more, like this more of my identity. Language, culture, and identity are entwined. So these new teachers will be teaching the next generation so much more than words. Bonnie Allen, CBC News, Regina.